Welcome to Pi International Education. In this video, we'll be taking a look at an introduction to the speaking module of your IELTS exam. So the speaking module of IELTS is a little different with the setting when compared to the other three modules of reading, listening, and writing. Mainly in your speaking module, you will have to have a conversation directly with an examiner. And the setting is in that sense very different and the environment is also very different. So the speaking module, it tests your fluency and accuracy in how you communicate in the English language. Now there are a few things that you know students do have trouble with in the speaking module which makes it one of the major modules where students have a little bit of fear but if we learn the techniques and tricks on how to approach these different kinds of fears or approach these different kinds of problems we can do much better in the speaking module one of the main things in the speaking module is that since you're sitting directly with an examiner you don't have the time for uh, the kind of preparation that you need before you give your response you are directly having to give your response on the spot while you're speaking to someone. So that is one thing that uh, many students face challenges with, but we will be working on that throughout this course. Another aspect of the speaking module is that often students get really nervous while in the environment or setting of speaking directly to somebody for the exam. Not only is it an examination, you also have to prove your communication skills to someone you've probably never seen in your life before. So because of these two major things, a lot of students might feel hesitant when it comes to the speaking module, but we will approach these different weaknesses and try to bring out the strengths in us for the speaking module. So what are the parts of the speaking module? In the speaking test, you will have three different parts. Let's take a look at what these different parts are. In your speaking part one, you will be tested on your conversational skills. So by conversational skills, we mean your ability to communicate with another person in the English language. So in part one, the examiner asks you questions based on yourself, your background, your job, your hobbies, etc general questions just about you and they test your ability to communicate in a conversation with someone in English. Part two of the speaking test tests what we call your narrative skills. Now these are skills that judge how well you can talk about a topic in the English language, how you can narrate a specific event or uh, describe a specific uh, situation or experience in the English language. Part three judges you on how you respond to what we call a critical argument using proper reasoning and also uh, clarity. So how well you can respond to a structured argument. Let's say you're given a topic and the examiner will then question you based on uh, the specific topic and try to understand how you can explain your reasoning and how clear you are in how you convey the meaning. So these are the three different aspects on which you are judged in your speaking module, we'll be taking a look at each of these different parts in more detail. 